Welcome to this video tutorial on conducting online job searches. Job searches are so much easier with all the online tools, job sites, and resources available. But how do you get results from your online searches? In this virtual field trip, we are going to provide you with a few tips about how to do just that. Let's get started. Tip number one. Using job sites such as Indeed, Monster, and Workopolis. Most of these job sites allow you to post your resume, so make use of that and keep your resume current. You can also set up alerts on some of these sites or use their recommendation feature. Use the advanced search feature to try different combinations of searches. When you apply for a position using the job search site, make sure you add a personal cover letter that shows you know something about the position and company you are applying to. Don't send a blank email with a copy of your resume. Tip number two, using a search engine such as Google. Make sure you know how to use the advanced search features such as Boolean search to add or subtract a search phrase. For example, if you want to search for a computer programmer job, that also does project management, you can put in computer programmer plus project management as a search phrase. This will get better results. Tip number three, finding your industry websites. Refine your search even more by visiting your industry's national or regional website where you can find jobs in your field that might not appear on a national job board. Tip number four, narrowing your search by company. Find a company you want to work for and target that company and then contact the hiring manager, usually the HR manager or recruitment manager. Many employer career pages invite visitors to fill out candidate profiles describing their background, jobs of interest, salary requirements, and other preferences. Make sure to set up for email updates. Tip number five, use LinkedIn to find and apply for job postings. This is explained in another section of this module. Tip number six, getting from online to a real person. From company websites, look for ways to connect personally with someone at the company through email. If the email you need is not on the website, one way to find this out is to call the company's general contact phone number and ask, I'm trying to connect with your HR department. May I have the name and email contact of your HR manager or recruiter? Then send a respectful email with your resume to someone in HR and a key company decision maker, such as a vice president or head of department. In your email cover letter, explain what interests you about the company and ask for a tour or meeting to get to know the company better. That is more likely to get your response than asking for a job. Hope you're getting some good ideas for how to narrow down your search more effectively. Remember, the more you look, the better your personal skills will become. Happy job hunting!